Hi Derek with the Lemonex. We're going to be spraying some carpenter bees today. Uh, I'm not trying to kill all the bees on the property. I'm just going to create, first going to create a barrier to get these male bees to uh, uh, hopefully get to another property. And then I'm going to go and then use another chemical to get inside that rake board, inside the groove, and get the nesting bees out of there. So we're just creating like a barrier here. Special outdoor product, it's safe for outdoors after it dries, safe for pets, safe for plants and ornamentals. It's actually designed for ornamentals. It's a, re it's a residual waterproof repellent. It doesn't leave any residue. It doesn't hurt the paint. And it works great for mosquitoes and ticks. And uh, we'll give it a nice coat there. And then I'm going to wait, wait for that to dry. That'll take about 20 minutes. And I'm gonna go in with a another product and go into those into the rake board. See that little groove groove up there? I'm gonna spray in there. That's where the nesting bees are. And hit the fence area and create a barrier for the fence. And car, the, the, it's stained, but I want to create a barrier on the property to reduce the uh, incoming population of bees because. The carpenter bees will hopefully just go to a neighboring property where there's the carpenter bees are nesting in their property. So we'll just kind of basically make this uh, this general area attractive and be really strategic so we're not overdoing it. And by by next see there's, there's bees on the, the neighboring property. See they're on his property too. So, so we'll put a little residual on this side of the fence and that will slow down the uh, ongoing swarm. Uh, you get the idea. So uh, I'm going to finish up here and we're going to go to the next property.